Okay, guys, to continue our Sunday giving day, we're going to be making some red beans and rice. So what you're going to need for this recipe, you're going to need some rice. I already took the rice out, wash it and clean it. So I just got to put it into the pot. I have some water here. I have some red beans. I have uh, some onions, some thyme, some rosemary and some oregano in here. And so now I have some garlic and I have some butter. Now, normally we would put coconut milk in red beans and rice. This time I'm not going to put coconut milk. Now you can add coconut milk if you want to, but I'm not going to add it. I'm going to just do it with water. Okay. And it gets a really nice flavor. Very enjoyable as well. Okay, here to get started, we're gonna add some butter to a pot. And just let it melt a little bit. While that melts, we're gonna add some garlic. And we're gonna toss it around a little bit in the pot. Now we're going to add the onions and thyme, oregano, and rosemary. We're going to add it in here and just let it saute a little bit as well. Now you can take the thyme and the oregano and all that off the stem. But I already washed it with the stem and I like cooking red beans and rice with the stem on the, um, with the stem on the thyme and the oregano and stuff. I love cooking it with the stem. But you can take the leaves off the stem if that's um, your preference. We're going to saute it for about five minutes. Or three minutes. Five minutes is a bit too long. So we're going to say three minutes. Just so everything can release its juices and stuff in the butter. Now we're going to add our beans and the rice. We're going to add the rice as well. And we're going to give it a good stir. Okay, so we are going to season this a little bit with some salt, some black pepper, some ginger powder, a little bit of pepper flakes, and some all-purpose seasoning. And we're going to just drop this in here. Because we want the peas and rice to still have some taste, okay? When you have red beans and rice, you should be able to eat some of it by itself without having to put anything on it. So it must have good flavor. And we're going to add water to the pot. Then I give it a good stir. Taste and make sure that your flavor is good. And my flavor is very good. And now what I'm going to do is turn the stove down to medium. And then I'm going to cover it. And let 
the rice steam through. Well, we're going to keep checking it, but we're going to give it a good 15 minutes, okay? All right, guys, 25 minutes and we're done. This steam nicely for me. You can see it's nice and loose. It's not clammy or anything like that. I'm going to put it in a bowl and let you see the finished look. All right, this is it. Red beans and rice. Very quick, easy, and simple and very tasty. I am truly going to enjoy this. All right, guys, this is it. This is it for our video.